kinetic architecture allows for certain parts of a structure to move without compromising its integrity. And some of these designs look unbelievable. So join me as we take a look at 15 of the most incredible kinetic buildings in the world. Number 15. Kulding University of Southern Denmark Henning Larsen has made quite a name for himself within the world of modern architecture, so when people heard the news that he would be designing for the Kolding University of South Denmark, they were pretty excited. Larsen went ahead and created a climate-responsive facade for the university that would clearly display the ever-changing climate of not just the Earth, but of the university and student life. The facade is composed of triangular shapes with just a hint of color on the white textured surface to draw the eye around the building. In total, there are around 1,600 of these triangular motifs, which doesn't just look great, but also help to regulate and control the temperature in the building. These motifs are equipped with sensors that monitor the heat and light levels around the university building, which allows for the facade panels to move and shift between open and closed as need be. But even when they're fully closed, there's still just enough space for the natural light to shine in through a custom pattern of rounded holes. Number 14. M9C Building The M9C Building in Paris is the latest and greatest when it comes to urban multi-use buildings. Aside from sounding like a Terminator model, M9C is composed of residential spaces, a school, and a theater, making it a one-stop shop where culture and everyday living can meet and exist in harmony. But many of these residences here have something that you'd be hard-pressed to find anywhere else. Each residence has special kinetic shutters as part of their facade, so instead of your grandpa's shutters, which collect dust all too easily and the strings are constantly becoming tangled, the shutters at M9C are perforated aluminum folding shutters. There's no doubt that they look great from the outside, but they also serve a purpose for the folks on the inside. And we're not just talking about letting in light or getting some privacy. These shutters provide much-needed insulation and heat during the winter months in Paris. And while we shudder to think what people living in MC9 would do without them, these special kinetic shutters add quite a bit to the property value here. Number 13. Shinjenshi Museum China has all sorts of fantastic and tall buildings that will just blow your mind, but the Shinjenshi Museum is a little different. While it does look absolutely amazing on the outside, it still manages to have a bit of an understated look, all things considered. The Shinchinchi Museum was designed by Kengo Kuma and Associates, a China-based firm, to create a more inviting facade. The entrance to the museum is right by a Taoist holy site, and so much of the museum is dedicated to the Eastern form of thought with religious exhibitions. And so, the facade of the building is encompassed by an interesting formation, hundreds of hanging tiles, all of which are made using local materials. That's pretty cool. These tiles are hung in all sorts of patterns to each side of the museum to create a unique and flowing pattern from just about every angle. It's an incredibly cool motif that adds a bit of movement to a stationary structure. Number 12. Industrial Technology Research Institute Taiwan has been at the forefront of cutting-edge technology for some time now, so why not have their architecture keep up with the times too? The Industrial Technology Research Institute in Taiwan aims to do just that. This building was designed by Noise Architects, who built the exterior wall as a light and free-flowing design that would create a soft, veil-like curtain as the facade. The kinetic facade consists of 4,000 individual fins, all offset from the curtain walls to create a double-skin building envelope. It's an incredibly serene masterpiece, and if you look at it from the right angle, the fins appear as a gentle wave over the institute. But it's the double-skin envelope composition that allows the hiding of the maintenance space in between, while still providing the flexibility for future additions of pipes and ducts without affecting the appearance of the building. So not only does it look great, but it's also incredibly clever at hiding all of the things you don't want to see. But hey, that's just good design. Number 11. Ports 1961 Who said that a store can't have a great design? And when you're working with a flashy luxury fashion house like Ports 1961, then the exterior better reflect the interior, because beauty is only skin deep after all. Their flagship store in Shanghai is designed by the Canadian-based studio Ufai and is meant to resemble the shape and look of an iceberg right in the middle of the bustling Shanghai streets. So how did this Canadian firm go ahead and create such an ice-cold facade? 
While the facade consists of two different sized glass blocks, it really is that simple. And so during the day, the building and the glass reflect the subtle changes in the daylight. But then at night, all of the LED lights embedded and hidden within the building's masonry come on and really let the building come to life. Number 10. Al-Bahar Tower Abu Dhabi is the governmental center of the UAE, and the city has a tendency to build big, flashy buildings that let them show off their immense wealth to the rest of the world. And when you've got all of the money, you can afford to have some of the most creative minds come around and work for you. The Al Bahir Tower in Abu Dhabi is one funky looking tower, to say the least. It almost looks like a giant pineapple or beehive climbing its way up to the sky. But this unorthodox facade has both a story and a purpose. The facade is inspired by the Islamic principles of design and a spiritual context to it. The facade of Al-Bahir Tower is totally responsive, and these motifs open and close depending on the movement of the sun, keeping everyone inside warm and toasty, but without turning the heat up too much, increasing the heat insulation by 50%. And so while the tower may be a bit gaudy to the untrained eye, it does a perfect job of combining both traditional and modern techniques. Number 9. Galleria Center City when you're designing a building, you typically want to give some insight to any onlookers as to what may be going on inside, but not with this next entry on our list. So despite how it looks on the outside, the Galleria Center City is a clothing store in Chenonan, South Korea. It sticks out like a sore thumb amongst the neighboring buildings. Even though this is a massive silver block of a building, its look is still quite minimal and understated while keeping things fresh and curious. What more could a designer ask for? South Korea's Galleria Center City has a double-layered facade that hides the total number of floors in the building, and its media facade is one of the largest in the world. The Galleria Center City is especially radiant at night when it comes to life, totally illuminating the area with its designs and light shows, and the facade itself reflects the sunlight absolutely perfectly during the day. And so, despite the strange silver blob-like look, the Galleria Center City is one of the most inviting buildings around. Number 8. Brisbane Airport Nine out of ten times, going to the airport is an absolute miserable experience. The line, the screaming children, the overpriced food, and the hassles of security. But how about that one time then? When can going to the airport be anything but drab? Well, that's if you go to the Brisbane Airport in Australia. That's because it's working with an awesome and futuristic kinetic parking garage facade. It's an eight-story endeavor that, when viewed from the outside, looks like the entire structure is rippling in one gorgeous fluid motion. In total, this effect is made possible by the whopping 118,000 suspended aluminum panels that will move in the wind. And so as the wind patterns change, so do these panels. It's actually a really cool effect that will have you forgetting about all the headaches surrounding air travel. But the best part about this kinetic parking structure at Brisbane Airport is at night, the facade is fully illuminated. So couple that with the movements from the wind and you're looking at one of the coolest kinetic facades around. Number 7. Viking by Crown Since we're already here, why not stay in Australia for a bit? But this time we're moving over from Brisbane and into the nation's capital of Sydney. Viking by Crown is an incredibly luxurious 10-story residential development offering 108 apartments across two towers for those that can afford it. The complex is complete with a gym, an outdoor pool, and even some ground floor retail areas. This place is totally awesome. But it's the facade of the Viking bike crown that really has people talking, and it shouldn't be too hard to tell why. Not only does the structure itself look a bit like an open book dominating the horizon, but the kinetic pieces that jut out throughout. The kinetic facade is only revved up by the form with incredibly sharp angles and bright colors that give the structure its pop. So as you're driving by the Viking by Crown, it's meant to appear as if the building is changing colors, from red to yellow as you roll down the street. The building is so cool, in fact, that it was shortlisted as one of the 25 coolest buildings when it was unveiled in 2015. Beat that. Number 6. The Kiefer Technic Showroom Now we're officially entering the big leagues with this next entry on our list. The Kiefer Technic Showroom is an office building and exhibition space designed to put a smile on your face when you walk through these front doors on your way to work. But aside from looking nice, the Kiefer Technic Showroom in Austria seems to have a mind of its own. But don't worry, the building isn't alive. It's just another structure with a kinetic facade that changes based on the conditions of the great outdoors. 
The coolest aspect here is that each space inside can be controlled by the user to optimize the internal climate however they see fit without running up a high energy bill. The showroom is an excellent example of what kinetic facades are capable of when they're going into the future. The shell construction here is made of solid brick walls, reinforced concrete ceilings and floors, and steel encased columns, with a facade consisting of aluminum posts and transoms that expand and contract depending on the sun. The designers and architects even managed to incorporate some well-hidden built-in bridges along the exteriors to allow for maintenance workers to repair any panels that may be a bit out of whack. Number 5. Leewood Speculative Office As we've already seen, you've got to just try and make an office building look cool, and hopefully the better looking the outside is, the happier the folks on the inside will be. That was the goal, at least, with the Leewood Speculative Office. It's located in Kansas to attract some more of the exciting high-tech companies slowly but surely moving into that area. But the majority of the surrounding buildings being beige, small-windowed, mansard-roofed, and flat-out boring buildings, the Leewood office would be a sight for sore eyes standing out amongst the crowd in all bright white. This 18,000-square-foot two-story venture is a simple yet elegant design with a rectangular floor plan with a totally concrete structure with an all-glass enclosure. You really don't have to be fancy at all to be flashy. Sometimes the simplest design is the best. The Leewood spec office also has its carefully and intentionally positioned perforated metal scrim that not only moves about with the fluctuating breezes, but helps to regulate the building's heat throughout the year. Number 4. Debenham Store Debenhams is an incredibly popular fashion brand in the UK, but their store on Oxford Street in London really takes the cake. Oxford Street is known for having some of the best and perhaps most upscale fashion and shopping in the world, which is why people come from far and wide to spend their money there. And it's so important for the storefronts to look just as good as the clothes they sell, and the people coming in and out of the shops will appreciate that. The Debenham store on Oxford Street went through a recent makeover in the last few years and was given a full facelift with 180,000 hanging brushed aluminum panels. So not only do the panels move about to help facilitate various levels of heat on each floor of the building, but they just look plain good from the street view. And much of that aesthetic is due in part to the floodlights that illuminate just about every inch of the store's facade in the evening. But despite all the lights and attractions just begging for your attention, the Debenham store on Oxford Street doesn't have any windows. So if you don't know what's inside, then you must not be one of the cool kids. But unfortunately, now no one can go inside, as the elegant storefront closed for good in May of 2021, after about 242 years in existence. Number 3. Torque House Living in a private residence comes with plenty of perks. You don't have anyone living above you, you can do what you want, and if you're lucky, you have plenty of hedges and trees to maintain your privacy. But what if you don't have a green thumb? Are you destined to hide behind the confines of a wooden fence that still needs to be maintained? Well, if you're living in the Torque House, then no. Designed by Wolveridge Architects, the Torque House in Australia is without a doubt the coolest house on the block and uses the building's facade to give the folks inside some much-needed privacy. The house is really one big experiment that luckily passed with flying colors. During the day, the Torque House looks like one giant block of wood because of the timber battens covering the facade, so absolutely no one can see inside during the day. And at night, the cube lights provide plenty of light to obstruct anyone trying to sneak a peek from the outside in. It's another simple yet absolutely genius design that gives you everything you could want in a modern yet pricey home. Number 2. Breath Box Now that we've reached our penultimate entry, we can all have a seat and take a deep breath at the Breath Box in France. Built by NAS Architecture, the French Breath Box takes both art and architecture to the next level in this home along the ocean. The design helps to explore the duality between the winds and the sea, with 300 separate mirrors all attached to the main wall to help reflect the calmness of the oceans. But when wind enters the structure, that's when things really get cool, and the individual mirrors all flutter about to quite literally reflect the chaos of nature. The breath box is a visual and sensory feast for the eyes that invites any and all to get up close and personal with it by entering the structure and seeing it for a demonstration in true wind power. Number 1. The Quilted Cube We can all use some peace and quiet sometimes, but how about a little peace and quilt? Well, that's exactly what Catalonian designer Enric Ruiz Gelli of Cloud9 had in mind when he designed the Quilted Cube. 
found in Barcelona, Spain. The quilted cube is a building with a two-layered facade that can inflate or deflate according to the sun. The quilted cube is actually quite cool to see in person because the south facade has 104 cushions with an ETFE membrane connecting them all. The center of the building is penetrated by an L-shaped hole from the roof down to the center of the structure and then reaches outwards toward the southwest facade to create the appearance of raining light. But the membranes only allow for the desired amount of sunlight to enter, so the building never gets too crazy. The Quilted Cube is also a mixed-use office building for technology companies with lots of public galleries and facilities, and it's even one of the most energy efficient of its kind in Spain, reducing the need for air conditioning and keeping energy costs down. The Quilted Cube is the Goldilocks of kinetic buildings, neither too hot nor too cold, always just right. Watch our binge-watching playlist if you'd like to watch all of our most popular top 15 videos. Grab a drink, grab a snack, and get ready to binge.